There's always gonna be that one guy that thinks his favorite anime is the greatest of all time. And every show and manga has those people. It could be the most mediocre and bland content that's almost unanimously agreed upon in the community is the worst creation within the observable universe. And there'd still be a wall of ass lickers saying, nothing can tap it. It's just years, years ahead of the competition. No other anime other than Dragon Ball Z has the epitome of these overloyal fanboys, or you know, let's call them uh, ulfs for short. Every other show whether it's One Piece or Bleach, their alts are at least somewhat tolerable. You know, th th there's some exceptions, obviously, but for the most part, their community tries to keep each other in check. But DBZ, I can't fathom how much glue these niggas shoved down their esophagus to be acting this way. I'll be, I'll be enjoying some, some, uh, what, some, some cinnamon toast crunch, like, mm, th th that's some great cereal. Talking to another fellow anime enthusiast, hey man, even though I disagree that Zabuza has a cooler design than Grimja, I can still see where you're coming from. Out comes the five-star general of the Dragon Ball Z fan club, eyes blazing with unwavering passion, feet firmly planted on the ground, in his hands holds a Bulma figurine he, he, he just jacked off to not even 10 minutes ago. He opens his mouth and he says, doesn't matter, Goku would beat both of them and then walks off into the sunset as if he just dropped some deep knowledge on us. Some, some, some food for thought that we'll be spending centuries trying to decode. For years, I've been trying to find a way to fix these DBZ ults, but so far every experiment has failed. I, I've tried uh, shock therapy, I've tried drowning them, I've even tried getting them addicted to other Asian content, but so far, nothing has worked. They continue to make random DBZ quotes in public. They continue to pretend that they're able to power up into a stronger being. They also unprovokingly tell strangers that Budokai Tenkaichi was the best game series, which they're absolutely right, but just the fact that they have to tell people is what makes them losers. Now I'd be a liar to say that there isn't any way to deal with these weeds, these parasites, you know, you, you can't cure them, but there is a way to deal with them. First you start out by starting up a conversation about anime or manga with a friend, uh, a family member, or anybody. They, they don't need to be a watcher of anime or even know what anime is, you just need someone you can talk to. Next, say something along the lines of, uh, Naruto is a really cool, you don't even have to finish that sentence. Because by the time you said the word Naruto, you should feel your back getting damp from the DBZ off breathing down your spine. You're just ready to butt in with his signature phrase, doesn't matter, Goku would beat him. And right as he says that, right as he says that, grab him, grab him before he can escape. Grab him straight by the collar, look deep into his eyes and say, true, but one punch man can beat all of them. That's when their brains begin to, to, to just fall apart, to crumble. But, 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 um, but, 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 what? But what? It doesn't feel good, does it? But, 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 Is, uh... Is he okay? Uh... I don't know. Let's get out of here before we get arrested, though. Sugar, honey, process. My, my sugar, size and Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola, not for me, my, my sugar, honey, process.